Uh, sure. My name is Stu Tanquist, and uh, the reason I came out here is just, it was just absolutely appalling. I mean, I can't stand the thought of what's going on, uh, what they're doing to children, what they're doing to families. I swear an oath to uphold the Constitution. Uh, we're in the right. We're doing the right thing, and uh, we're here to stay. Risking arrest is a, a pretty big step, and a lot of people wouldn't be prepared to uh, to take that risk. What led you to actually decide um, it's important enough to risk arrest? Uh, well, you know, I, everybody needs to make their own decision, and um, I'm I'm in a place in my life where I can, you know, I, I've enjoyed privilege most of my life, and uh, um, you know, my my uh, kids grown. Um, so, so the impact on me is much less, and so, but we have, you know, and we have lots of people giving all kinds of support. You know, not everyone can get arrested. Um, we just ask people come out, come out for an hour, come out for two hours, hold the sign, help us, you know, be visible, um, because you know we all need to come together um, to deal with this and to abolish ICE. And what do you see about the uh, positive aspects of what's happening at the camp? Do you see that as a model for uh, a better world, a better way of organizing society? I really do. Um, this is this camp is absolutely extraordinary. I mean, we have th th there's no one in charge. There's not a group that you know made this, and, and you know we work under the leadership. This is an autonomous community. And the people in it are amazing. What we've done here in the last week and a half is extraordinary, uh, and it's it's so empowering. Um, this is this is more like what society should really be, you know, where we're taking care of each other and helping each other and living together, working together. It, it, we are so atomized in our society. You know, people live in their little box and they look at their little digital viewing devices and think they understand the world. Right, we need we need face to face, and we need to live together, work together, um, to you know, to to help each other make the world a better place. And and you know, it, it, we've got a long way to go.